Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys and today guys I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to get a GPX file from Strava. This is a very simple thing to do guys so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly so you can make sure this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So guys, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up the official Strava application on your mobile phone if you haven't already. And after opening up the application guys, you'll be greeted by the main page where you can go ahead and log into your account. So go ahead and log into your account or if you do not already have one, just create one. And after logging in, you'll be greeted by this main page right here, which is the home page of Strava where you can see all of our stats, we can see our progress and so on. So guys, let's go ahead and see how to export GPX files. So the first thing we want to do guys is find the activity we want to export the file for so look at the bottom part of the screen right here where we can see the home section we can see maps record and so on and now what we want to do is go ahead and click on the U section right here in the bottom right corner click on you and after clicking on you guys this is going to open up this new page right here where we can see we can manage our progress and activities at the bottom part of the screen so we want to go ahead and click on activities and after clicking on activities guys it's going to give us a list of all the past activities we have so go ahead and find activity you want to export the file for click on the activity and after clicking on it it's going to open up this new menu right here where you can go ahead and manage the activity and in the upper right corner next to the three dots is going to be a share button so click on the share button and now guys if you see all the options you have right here you can see that we have a save to files option so guys go ahead and click on save to files and after clicking on save to files this is going to export your file and that you'll be able to upload or use different where so yeah guys basically that is it how to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel so yeah guys thanks for watching take care and bye